So we know that he had a heart attack because of the fact he was attacked by a taser. We're confident of the fact that had he not come in contact with the Baltimore City Police Department, he would still be alive today. Why? Because he came with a simple issue in relationship to some dental stuff. That was the cause of him coming into the hospital. He was not here in relationship to anything having to do with his heart. Why would a healthy 19-year-old boy have a heart attack except for the fact that he was tasered? He was tasered not once, not twice, not three times, not four times, but five times. Not by one officer, not by two officers, but two members of the Baltimore City Police Department and five security officers. It's murder, it's excessive force, it's police brutality, and we are not going to take it. We're not going to take it because it still takes a village to raise a child, and we are indeed part of that village. Because unity is indeed part of our community. And we're not going to continue to, we're not going to stop holding Greg Bernstein accountable. We're going to continue to demand that he gets up off his ass and prosecute cases in relationship to our children. Yeah. We're going to continue to demand the end to the double standard that exists between the Baltimore City Police Department and average, everyday, hardworking citizens. We're going to demand that elected officials do their damn job. We're tired of capitalism running the show. We're tired of our recreation centers being shut down. We're tired of our schools being shut down. We're tired of thousands. We're tired of the same neighborhoods consistently being shortchanged. We're tired of the same children. Oh, and when we get a repair 